This was a highly requested video from my last post, so here you guys go. I woke up hella early to do this too. You can see I was messing up the cave, I was yawning. I started off by brushing my hair down and using this trimmer. This is where I'm going to set my first guideline with the trimmer. Double check and make sure that line is symmetrical and then once you're done, bald it out. This is the clipper I used to blend. Make sure the lever is open. For the first guideline, I like to make sure I cut a finger length and you can see it's about an inch. Next, you're going to grab your one guard and make sure the lever is open once again and then go up a finger length, which is about an inch. Now you have section one, you have section two. I'm gonna be working on section one. Take off that one guard again and close that lever halfway. We are only gonna be working on section one and you're gonna go up halfway with that lever halfway open. And you can see I made another line. Open the lever just a little bit and then go above that line. And then once you're done with that, go a little bit more open and go above that line. Here's a pro tip. Make sure to stretch out the skin so you have more room to blend. Next, close the lever all the way. We are trying to blend that first line. Make sure to go up and don't dig in the skin like that. I'm only going to be showing you guys a little section. So we're going to work right there. So we're opening up the lever just a tad and then going up just a little bit. And sometimes if you see like a really harsh line, you go back with the trimmer and then try to erase it. Now, once you're done with that, it's time to work on the next section. Put back the one guard and then we're going to close it halfway. And we're only going to go up halfway on that section. And once you finish that, we're going to close the lever all the way. And you're only trying to hit that line that you see right there. It's a struggle to get the back, trust me. So there should be a slight line and you're going to get the half guard and close it up halfway. And then you can go up and try to attack that line. And if there's still lines, here is a hack for you. So you're going to grab shears and you're pretty much going to thin out the hair. You can see that there's still some dark spots. So I'm going to attack it and you're going to see how it blends in nicely. Sheesh! Now there's still some dark spots up there, so now we're gonna go up with the one and a half guard and open it all the way. And it's pretty much the same process, but with bigger guards. So right now we're using the one and a half, and now we go with the two. And once the hair is long, you gotta make sure you gotta brush it down because sometimes it'll go up and you can't blend. At this point, the two guard is closed. I still saw some dark spots, so I attacked it with the shears. So for the last step, I want you to be very careful to use the blade, use it at your own risk. I like to give mine a C cup, so this is what it looks like. And you guys already know I gotta hit it with the powder once again. Thank you again for watching. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.